Hey guys, welcome back to Suicidal Survival. It's very spooky. It's dark. It's dangerous. There's a Buddha behind me. Say hi. Hi. He's creepy. <laughs> it's creepy. That was the intern. Okay. Yay. See you. Creepiness. Last time we managed to finish the high oven here, meaning that we have a pretty good way of refining a lot of ores very quickly. Now there is a backside to that, and that is we don't have a quick way to obtain a lot of ores easily. Ooh. Because of, you know, mainly the gas mod, honestly. That uh, that does take its toll on, on mining. We've just been down mining a bit, trying to get a bit more eulorium and such, and um, it's we spend more time dancing around gas than we have um, actually mining stuff, so... We both blew up a couple times. Yeah. So, at the moment, we have our deep tank here with a lot of stuff inside. Now, for some reason, since I'm recording, the uh, interface here is actually bu bugging. Yeah, I saw that too, that the uh, the liquids aren't showing up. Yeah, they're just stopped. I, I don't know if that means we just need to quickly update it with, um, you know, just try and pour out an ingot here or something. No, because it did it whenever I was pouring out uh, steel. Well, it's not steel that's at the bottom now. No. That's uh, tin. Let me see if I click. I can't even organize them. No. All right. That is a problem. That is a problem, but um, good thing we pulled out a lot of stuff then before, huh? Yeah. So inside that thing, we have, you know, hundreds and hundreds of ingots of various kinds. Uh, now, the good thing about the deep tank is it doesn't alloy, meaning that we can just slowly craft whatever we want to craft with the stuff that we pull out of there. Um, like, we, we can pour it out in select amounts. We can even put put down, like, a tank and pump into the tank and then pump it from the tank into the smeltery if we really need to make an alloy from it. Or we can just melt it down again. Like, it's all um, choices. All the choices that we have. We can just do whatever the we want. The uses are infinite. They are, pretty much. For so, what its purpose is. Anyway... Any, anyway <laughs> Coming back to the whole getting an easy source of ores, we actually have two choices now. And um, we actually have three choices even. We can make all the all the things we want. So the obvious the the, the there is one the one choice is the deep dark. Because the deep yes. dark doesn't generate with the gas mod. Which does, is fantastic. It, ha it does have a lot of mo uh, mobs and you we need to light it up even more because of you know the darkness actually hurting us. So lots and lots and lots of torches, but it doesn't have gas, and it does have the double ore density, meaning that we can, you know, find a lot of stuff very rapidly. The next mm. choice is magical crops, and basically just growing the stuff we need. Since we have the um, the fantasy metals now, we can get started on that. Um, but that's sort of a passive thing that doesn't really, you know, take much effort once we start it up, so that can kind of take care of itself. The third choice we have is the laser from Mine Factory. Now this thing produces ores just um, by being active, but it does consume a lot of power. So if we ever were to power one such thing, we would need, um, at the very least, a big reactor from uh, the Big Reactors mod. Now luckily, the Big Reactor, um, it's actually made with steel, and we have made a ton of steel <laughs> in no the, uh, the high oven. So that's not too far out from us, actually. Like, we can do that. We can most definitely do that. Should we so this higher? Which I think we do. Yes. Yes, indeed. But which do we desire more at the moment? Do we desire deep dark or do we desire the uh, reactor? Uh, well, the deep dark is going to take some time to get started because we need to make a lot of cobblestone for that. Right. So what we actually need, like, um, we need to get at the very least one Ignis extruder going making cobble. So that means a machine frame, a piston, a pneumatic servo, and a bunch of other shit. I don't think we have any more machine frames actually saved up, so we might have to make a couple of new ones there. Yeah, it looks as though we need to make some new machine frames. Neat. So, uh, let's get started on that. Um, do you want to get started on that? Just crafting machine the frames? Ign Ignis Extruder? And actually make a couple extra machine frames, because we're also going to need a cyclic assembler. Where is it? Oh, igneous extruder. Okay, so I need how you many need some, of these? You need some hepatison. Uh, make like make three machine frames. 
Okay, so that's Hepatison, ingots, yeah. and steel, and a motor. Hepatison, we have seven, I think. Okay. Uh, let's see, Hepatison does that. It's three bronze and one one gold. We do have some thing as alloy, but I'd prefer to just, you know, mix together some, some tin and some cardboard. So I'm wondering if we should just, you know, get the smeltery working on making more of that. Yeah, I'll, I'll get the, the smelter here going. So, that, and a bit of gold. There we go. I haven't measured it out completely, but it, it should give you some hepatosome before too long. I also yeah. put, put in an extra bucket of lava. I'm just going to take one more from our engine here, so that's enough. Yeah, because we've then, only got the seven. And then I'm going to move on to getting the uh, magical crop st started up. Okay. Because that's also a pretty decent way to, you know, get some stuff without us having to work too hard for it. <laughs> too hard. Too hard, exactly. So I'm wondering if I if we can actually make essence seeds. I don't think we can. Um, which means that um, you know we're gonna have to just make the basic seeds that we want. Now, what basic seeds do we actually want to get? We want to get a glowstone seed, don't we? Um, I don't. I, yeah, sure. <laughs> yeah. So I'm gonna need a bunch of carmod and a bunch a bunch of in fuscolium, and then I need to find some essence dust, which I some think we all have stuff. done. Some essence stuff. Essence stuff. Okay. Essence. Now the essence stuff is not the limiting factor in this. That's definitely the uh, the, uh, the 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 ma uh, magical things here. So the weak essence here, I can make coal seeds, dye seeds, fire seeds, water seeds, air seeds, earth seeds, and yeah. But I want regular essence, so I need to get four of these, and that means I need to get twelve weak essence. Which means I need to get a bit more. There we are. <laughs> Your essence is weak. Twelve of these, and then I upgrade these again. Using the Kamod and the Infoscolium. Four. And then I can make redstone, I can make glowstone, I can make copper, obsidian, and tin seeds. And I think the glowstone one is definitely worth it for us because glowstone is a bit of a pain to get out of the nether. Yeah. And, um, you know, the more options we have for getting lights, the better it is. There we are, glowstone. Like, we do have a bit of glowstone saved up, but on the other hand, um, you know, having some sort of automatic creation of it. Can't possibly be a bad thing, huh? No, never. Alright, so I need to find a seed. Just a normal standard seed. I think I need to go upstairs to the kitchen for that. Yeah, I do. So, a bark standard seed. Oh, yeah. And that'll give me one tiny little glowstone plant. Yay! that I can nurture, and play with, and sing to. Are you talking about your wiener again? No, I'm talking about my glowstone plant. Oh, okay. Just double checking. So where do we want to plant this, this uh, precious thing? And also, where is our hoe? Oh shoot, how many igneous extruders did we need? How many did you make? I, well, I made three pneumatic servos, that's why I was asking. Well, we, we can always use more servos. Okay. Like, that that makes the pipe so much easier to work with, so... Uh, we Do we only need, what, what, one? Well, one yeah, we need one. Like, we, we can su supplement the uh, the cobblestone generation with some uh, some of the stuff we mine ourselves. Okay. Like, we Perhaps need mine. one. We can always use more, but we only need one. Let's say ten. So, where do we want to plant this glowstone seed, Buddha? Um... Somewhere... Um... Where we can keep an eye on it and yeah, harvest, that it, makes and harvest sense. it easily. And I need a water source. Let me just quickly grab one here. We should probably fix that hole in the wall, huh? Uh, yeah. Should I put? Should I just put it? In <laughs> yeah, the, that it, seems like a pretty uh, yeah. good idea there. Should I just put it in the farm upstairs here somewhere?
Yeah, that probably work. Like we we hardly ever use this any up here anyway, so I'm gonna put it right next to the, the stairs here. Replace a bit of barley with it. Yeah, and we had four half patties and ingots in the uh, chest over there. Oh, nice. Yeah, um, so, what other seeds do we want to get? Do we want to get uh, maybe an iron seed? Like, I think iron is such a basic thing. Like, we need that for um, everything. Everything, yeah. Iron seed. Um, to see if you can make a half patterson. I can't make that, but we, can, you know, we can make the, all the ingredients for it. But I was just wondering if, um, if there was a yellowium seed. There is a uranium seed, but it doesn't appear to have a crafting recipe. No. No. I made three machine frames. Let's have a look. Where are the glass. essence exactly? They're strong essence. So, iron, gold, ender, blaze, experience, lapis, cow, nether, magma creeper. The nether one is pretty good, actually. Because it gives us nether quartz. Slime, skeleton, gas, spider, lead, silver, sapphire, silver quartz. Silver quartz could also be a good idea. At, at some point in the future. Ferrous, diamond, emerald, with the skeleton seeds. Cobalt, platinum. That doesn't really help us either. Copper, tin. Copper is kind of a thing we don't have too much of as well. Yeah, copper would be pretty good. Aluminum would be a really good one. Aluminium, sorry. Well, we don't really use any more aluminium now that we have the toolforge. Like, we've stopped using it to a certain degree. Yeah, but I you got to use it for uh, the machine frames. Oh, really? Yeah, you need uh, aluminium ingot on the, uh, the, 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 the motor that goes on the inside. So the aluminium, which essence level is that? That's... Um, Ah, uh, it's 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 strong essence. That's kind of that's kind of expensive. I can make I can make us a copper seed with what I have right now, but I think we're gonna pretty much run out of interscolium if uh, if we try to uh, to make much more. Gotcha. I think that that's the main thing that the interscolium is not the one that we got the most of, unfortunately. So one of us would have to go back to dreaming. Well, it wouldn't be too bad. Like we do have two brews of uh, two bruises leaving still, That's true. and um, we do have the inner chest for you know if, if whoever goes in, make sure to fill it up with good stuff before. But I think for now, I'm just gonna make another a, a copper seat as well. Then we have copper and glowstone go, uh, growing up there, and then maybe once we start harvesting those, they'll actually give us a couple of extra essences that we c so we can save on the the upgrading costs. Yeah. I need a workbench. I keep sprinting. Because I'm forgetting that I'm not playing... Uh, Greg Tech? G Greg Tech, yeah. In which I sprint all the time. <laughs> well, there's no reason not to there. Honestly. I'm, I'm, just, I'm just moving about slowly because, well... I don't know. Where, do we have any copper ingots ready? Uh, just well. I'll just cook up four here. Did I get some hepatison made? Why is it actually not making an alloy in here? It has bronze and it has gold. Those two together should give hepatison, but it's not. Uh, it's not alloying. There might not be enough gold to bronze. Well, it should. Oh, oh, right. It might be in a surplus of gold needed. Yeah. Like, it made Hap Hattison. I stole it all. And then, okay, then I think it, it uses uh, more gold. So I, I, put, I tossed in some more gold, just so we can actually go. go. Now we need a cyclic assembler as well. A what? A cyclic assembler. How do you spell that? Uh, Is it A-cyclic or a cyclic? No, cy cyclic. C-I-C-L-I-C. -I -C -L -I -C. 
B I C or C Y? C I. Uh, C Y. Yeah, C Y. Sorry. I'm stupid. Okay. Um. <laughs> 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 I'm just quickly gonna finish this copper seed, and then we can set up the uh, extruder here. Um, but we right. need, we need to get a steady supply of water for it, though. Like it, it, it works by consuming water, which actually, I didn't actually think that through because we don't have infinite water, yet. We do have replenishing water, yes, but it's not infinite. So I'm wondering nope. if, um, if if this cobblestone is going to end up actually being really expensive for us. In terms of, you know, how much water it's going to consume. I didn't think that completely through, did I? Uh, 